Hello, human. I'm Ho Bear the Meta Bear, a vaguely bear shaped geometric character in a video game. Ho Bear exists only to guide you through this world, such as it is. So when you skip my parts, that's kind of disrespecting my whole existence, okay? Okay, let's have some backstory. Pay attention to Ho Bear. Never and nowhere, there was this island called Kalimba, where a shaman woman watched over a totem pole as powerful as it was tall. And it was way tall. The people of Kalimba honored their shaman and lived in perfect spiritual harmony. One morning, an evil shaman emerged from the black depths of the sea, determined to mess with the positive vibes surrounding the island. <laughs> the evil shaman off the good shaman and scattered her totems all over the island. But a shaman lady's spirit magically lived on. And now she travels the island locating the missing totem pieces to build an even taller totem pole, regain her powers, and reclaim Kalimba for the Kalimbis. Which is where you come in. Because if we let her do everything, there would be no game. The shaman lady, still in her spirit form, quickly learned she could possess the small totem pieces around the island.
was much more to this game than just the A button. awaits those who can pick up everything without losing a life. Welcome to the meta space. Hope Bear has been prepping rooms in between the levels all around the island. It's something Hope Bear calls extra content. Anywho, a challenge for you. Get more than 15 pickups and a door on the other side of the room will open. You need to make it out of the room alive. You won't be able to, of course. You're gonna die. That's why I'm throwing a sweet achievement into the challenge. 
Hey, if you feel like quitting, you can always jump back through the spiritual teleport you came from. Get you still kicking. Seems like you've mastered the double jump skill. You've earned your achievement. Ugh, old bear doesn't care. Old bear's got a ton of these things. And anyways, loads of people have scored way higher than you, so. It appeared important to use the double jump all the time, the good shaman told herself.
This was a strange cave, with a strange floor, totally slippery like some sort of low friction material. know about the double jump? Cause this room is all about double jumping. Double jumping and staying alive. Uh, mostly staying alive. Anyway, 15 pickups, stay alive, receive achievement, and Bob's your uncle. It's not like you haven't tried something like this before in other games.
Yeah! Give me those pickups. Oh, here. Have your worthless achievements. Happy. It's like you discover a strange orb and suddenly your whole world turns upside down.
This new ability was pretty fun, she thought. It was as if the game was now more than just a straight-up platformer. Oh. Ah, you found out about the changeable gravity we have here on Kalimba. What a convenient phenomenon for this next challenge. Hobear has a feeling this could be a useful skill for you to master as you progress through the game. Go get him, human. Bear promised you an achievement, so here's your reward. Why do you want those things so much anyways? Is it because they make you feel like you're accomplishing something? Can't you just be satisfied with the fun of beating the game? Okay, whatever. You can have this achievement, but I've given it a ridiculous name. You've accomplished nothing.
One time she ran into a giant snake. He was sort of a boss in this first world, but the shaman wasn't worried. She already knew about his weak spots. Psst, the orange ones.
It sounded familiar and comforting, though it was anything but. The good shaman had never been so far from her village. She was about to experience the spirit cannons, and they were about to become like one of her favorite things. Oh, <laughs> 
had new and different ability orbs. See? Red with a bear on it. Oh, my God. 
She admired her new totem pole. It was getting really tall, she thought. Oh! 
the shame and wonder. Did they have a purpose beyond chasing her around? Thank you. 
the shaman lady traveled, the more she could sense her evil counterpart's presence. Did you ever talk to the evil shaman? He's an odd one. All he talks about is spreading those black triangles all over everything. I think he's hiding somewhere up high in the upper world, but you're gonna need to learn another ability before you can take him off. Exciting, right? What could it be? Hobear bets it's something awesomely creative and fun. Anyhow, there's a challenge room here. Keep on not dying if you can. Hold down!
Seems you're getting good at my games. Or maybe you just got lucky. Probably the latter, yeah.
Some enemies are just too big to kill. Take Holbear's advice in those situations. Run. Run away. Run far away!
stumbled through my spiritual teleport. And you're up to speed on the size ability? Peachy. Obear should warn you that the ground here is unstable. Avoid jumping to avoid untimely death. But how to reach those sky-high pickups? Obear awaits your solution. Excellent. Have you heard about this spiritual device called the Connect? In order to get this achievement, you must wave your hands at the Connect. Please start waving now. Good. Next, try it and stretch your arms out a little. Okay, now wave a little more. Holbear has a confession. This game doesn't support Connect. Hobear was just pulling your drumstick. But I have this achievement for your efforts anyways. It looked great. Thank <laughs> you. 
calculations, it's time for a boss fight right about now. Probably one where you'll have to size up.
upper world, a place of ethereal beauty. It seemed to be in the process of dissolving. If you agree, push B if you disagree. Ready? Is Ho Bear the greatest video game bear ever? Correct. Does walking around indoors with a spear make you look like a cool dude? Yes, that is correct again. Do you think quizzing is less fun than playing the actual game? Your answer is incorrect. No more quizzing then. Bye.
things! Aren't they great? It's almost like playing a normal game where you just have to control a single character. Almost. Have this achievement. You've earned it. Now the shaman can move one totem independently. A novel sensation after all that synchronous action.
level, a new kind of enemy was waiting. The pink and yellow enemies. They were... well, they were pink and yellow.
drawing near. The good shaman felt that if she climbed any higher, she would escape the game world entirely. Thank <laughs> you. 
Heed of Hober. Pay attention to any atoms of color. They carry great meaning.
Kalimba hides nine metaspace levels. To discover them all would be an achievement. Not like a cure for cancer achievement, but still. Oh, 
Bear's waking state was triggered this morning. He didn't think he'd be giving all his achievements to a couple of logs. Frankly, Hope Bear hopes you fail. Ah! 
Righteously PO'd, persistent human. And Hobear blames you. Take your reward. Happy? Hobear hopes so. Because Hobear is sad. And as I say, Hobear blames you. If you want more achievements, you must win them in boss fights. With her newfound abilities, she was able to ditch gravity altogether, which was great because this level was all vertical. Thank <laughs> you. 
course there was a great bird-type boss in the end of Upper World. She wondered if it would be the final boss. Oh.
shaman was no more. Defeated by true spiritual courage and sent back to the place from whence he came. And will you look at that pole? Pretty, isn't it? All carved and totemy and tall. This is what perfect spiritual harmony looks like. Oh, old bear's tired now, must rest. Leave me, human. Find your purpose as you were born to do. Thank you.